or if they tortured him. He said he'd been cut with the scalpel. And it also said that he had had skin in his teeth. I can make out fingerprints stained with blood and dirt. A broken bottle of whiskey. However, the Bishop of Knightsbridge was known for his sobriety. You can see by his expression that he suffered terribly. His mouth is covered in blood. And I can make out strips of skin between his teeth. Yeah, it's because he nodded his arm. figure out if they made him drink or not. His stomach is covered in scratches. Quite evidently, they weren't made recently. That was from the so belt he wore. His forearms have been ripped. Pieces of skin have... I'd say that he was eaten and... I don't know. If they would have made him drink it. A bottle of whiskey. I can make out fingerprints stained with blood and dirt. This stove is filled to overflowing. What's it filled with? Hmm. I cannot leave now. missing anything. It looks like he drank tea. I just don't know what to think of that question. What should we do next, Holmes? The rope from him, severed finger. Someone's finger got cut off, which is really weird. The broken flask. Stone scalpel. I think his shoes are missing because someone wore them out.
Murderers made the bishop drink blood. I don't think so. Made the bishop drink the contents of the flask. Murderers tortured the bishop with a broken glass. We found the scalpel, so we know that's what he was cut with. I think they made him drink the stuff, and he got drunk. And that's why he started gnawing at himself and acting crazy. We gotta figure the shoe thing out. One man joined those who were already in the room. He was carried so as not to leave footprints. One man joined those who were already in the room. joined those who were already in the room. I think one man left the room wearing different shoes. I think they left wearing the bishop's shoes. Strange, but true. One of the crooks was wearing a different pair of shoes when he left here. Okay. But now I gotta figure out why... How many criminals there were. We know those two and those two go together. I think there was three criminals. Well, or not. Well-worn shoes with an odd pattern on the soles. Maybe he came in with one pair, and then he left with the bishops. Well-worn shoes with an odd pattern on the soles. This print came from an expensive pair of shoes, and it seems recent. It is not a laborer's shoe. Hobnail boots, like hobnail boots. So I'm wondering if these are only shoe prints of when they came in, or is it when, or I mean when they left, or is it when they came in and when they left? Because then I would say, okay, here's the two criminals, and then one of them changed shoes. And here's the new pair they put on. Hmm, I'm gonna say two. Oh, it could be three though, that's a thing, I don't know. If it's if it's footprints of when they all left then there would be three. But if one of them changed shoes, then there would be the two coming in, and then there would be the footprints of when he changed shoes. That's not right. Start again. Three, then. Perfect. We now know that there were three crooks. So it's just when they left. Therefore, we have three men who came in and left again. But one of them was wearing a different pair of shoes from the ones which he came in with. So, all we have to do is look for a workman who likes Italian shoes. Oh, 
All right. Deduction table. Murder is left in different shoes. The bishop's shoes are missing. One of the murders, remember the clergy left wearing the bishop's shoes. One of the murders sells shoes. Murders are poor. One of the murders came back for his shoes. What? Came back for whose shoes? Probably they're poor, they're laborers, right? Bishop's murders were hired by some of the murders. Search for the bishop's shoes. Murders wanted to steal from the bishop. Or they could have been hired by someone. There we go. They're hired. It is evident someone. that the Bishop of Knightsbridge's killers were after something specific and that they did not find it. Reverend, I shall ask you one more time. Open the chest. The item they were seeking must still be inside. It is unlikely that they will let this matter rest. They will most certainly return what to finish what they What if that guy hired started. him? And I'm telling you once more, the chest is locked and shall remain so. Very Dude's well. A bitch. We have reached an impasse. You are a stubborn man, Reverend. Yeah. Watson, accompany our friend to the police station and return with Inspector Baines. Baines and no one else. I shall wait for you here. Go. Alone at last. All now right. I can continue my investigation. What are we going to look for here? We had something new. I don't have anything new. Where are we at? Oh, okay. This lock should be easy to pick. Oh, let's see. We get to pick locks. Um. This lock should be easy to pick. Let's see. Here we go. What are we doing here? That's not right. Start again. That's not right. Start again. Select and rotate. Oh, I see. I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, I have to match it to fit into there? This is really weird. up or down. There we go, it's much easier. There we are. It is simplicity itself. 